So I'm not even home right now. It is Tuesday, like 12.25. I'm moving tomorrow. I packed one box. One single box. And after I move, my friend's picking me up in Arizona and we're going to Vegas for Life is Beautiful. <laughs> you know, <laughs> a day after I move. I won't have my car in Arizona. So then I just kind of have to get home from Vegas, but like she lives in Arizona. So I don't know how I'm getting home yet, but you know, we always figure that out. It'll be fine. I'm also starting to get sick and I'm very concerned because that on top of moving, on top of going to Life is Beautiful is not gonna work out for me. Also, when I get back from Life is Beautiful, I have plans to go to Disneyland. So like, I can't be sick. I don't have time to be sick. I don't know how I'm gonna get my entire room packed. I thought like getting my entire room packed in a day, so easy. But like now I'm not gonna get home until like two ish. Wish me luck! I move in less than 12 hours and I haven't packed anything. Like one box. Just one. That's it. Nothing else. That's it. Went to Whole Foods though. I got a wellness shot in a smoothie size. Trying to make it to life is beautiful. <laughs> not trying, like I'm gonna make it and like go regardless of the, if I'm sick or not. No, we're gonna like dive out and like I'm gonna be not sick. We've been up since the crack of dawn. Only to wake up to my mom's boyfriend's car not working. And it's almost 11. 12 o'clock and the moving truck still isn't here. And I'm in California. And I guess if the moving truck gets here by like one, we'll probably be out of here by like two. And we'll probably get to Arizona when it's dark out. <laughs> It's okay, if I was moving my stuff in when I originally went to go get my keys to my apartment, you know, two months ago or three months ago, because I still have yet to move into my apartment. I would have not been moving until dark either because I didn't get my keys until seven hours after I got there to pick up my house keys. <laughs> These signs, should I not be moving to Arizona? <laughs> what is going on? And I'm supposed to be packing but I don't know what else I'm gonna pack. Because I'm coming back here on Monday. I'm trying to go to Disneyland. It's 2.30 and we're just leaving. I just ran back into my house to grab something out of my dresser when it's in the back of the car. My dresser is following me. It has been so many hours since I updated everyone. I'm already here. I already started unpacking. My roommate's asleep right now, so. My stuff is just literally everywhere. Already started unpacking. Like, what? It's midnight. I got here at like 7, 7.30. And I just started unpacking like five minutes ago, honestly. I got a lot done. All right, kind of moved in. Yeah, shit's just, shit's everywhere. But I got everything out of the living room, so that's good. My little touch, probably be more. Probably have some more updates later. All of these boxes. Last night, I swear I walked up and down these stairs like 50 times. No doubt, without a doubt, 50 times. My kitchen, of course, Chipotle. Off to Vegas! <laughs> Don't know how I'm getting home yet <laughs> from Vegas. Yay. <laughs> Just reminded Morgan that she could use the carpool lane because we were in dead yeah, south traffic. I'm not sinning this weekend. Not like that. 
other ways, sure. What do you mean not like that? Like they can just assume what kind of sins we mean? Yeah. <laughs> all right, so this is like San Francisco all over again, except for I'm not dying, Morgan isn't, but cause she's driving. <laughs> she has to pee, she's had to pee since we left my house. I've had to pee since I think 4 p.m. Morgan, <laughs> do you not pee at the houses you like work at? Not at the one I was at because it's a funeral. Because why? That's weird. No. Okay. She also has an Ian, which is like strange that it's not me that hasn't had any food. It's her. Actually, no, we're kind of the same. Yeah, I'm like, I never eat. Yeah. yeah. This is why us together is just kind of like scary I'm because. I'm going to in my backpack. Oh, yeah. Yes. <laughs> a whole last meal. <laughs> it's midnight and we're finally. Morning. This is just my morning routine. <laughs> the exercise. <laughs> yeah, wow. Look, I whipped it and it's curled. <laughs> <laughs> that's how you do it. You just whip it. That's the that's the new wave. Literally a wave. <laughs> Morgan won't update you guys with me. We didn't do any before stuff. We're dead. Yeah, we're dead. <laughs> Anyway, uh, we didn't show you guys our cute outfits. Already took off my makeup and my choker. I was like, you took off your makeup. <laughs> yeah, I look so like the same without it, <laughs> without the sparkly ass makeup. So we got um, free merch. Um. <laughs> you have your merch, you wanna show them? Oh, is always stripping on my vlog. Like this is the fucking fourth time she is stripped on my vlog. Sorry, it's a bad habit. This Free not like merch. <laughs> All right, what else were we supposed to tell them before I go shower? That we're bad bitches. Yeah, because um, we had to get trashy to get this merch for free. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. To go in depth on that. Or not. That's the story for tomorrow. No. <laughs> we're telling them now or we're not telling them. I'm tired. Oh, okay, you sucks. You're gonna be on your phone for like 20 more minutes. You're right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, all right, so we picked up trash for the trash. If you're seeing this, we already lost. Doesn't matter. <laughs> like, yeah, because we were supposed to win tickets the next year, but this girl won tickets to Nocturnal Wonderland or something. That should not be allowed. She should not be allowed to be back at a festival that she when she, like she knows the people. Yeah, that's kind of true. I call fraud. <laughs> yeah, she got 40 bags of trash. We got nine. And then we went up at the end of the night to check up on them. And we were like, hey, like, are we still winning? Because we were like 90% of the time. And they were like, no, like one girl's ahead of you by one. And I go, is it the girl that won last time? And they're like, well, not last year, but like out in Nocturnal Wonderland. And we were like, yeah, well, we give up now because we're not going day two and we're going day three. But like, we're just gonna finesse our way in because like that like always happens. Like the last two hours. Yeah. We're literally just, we're gonna get in to Good go see Post Malone. Good night, moon. Good night, Lance. Good night, Sydney. <laughs> You forgot. <laughs> 10,000 goodnight kisses. <laughs> that was only like four. That's 10. I just got timed by 10,000. Yeah, that's how you math. Life is beautiful was so much fun. We got front row because like I nearly passed out because like I didn't eat anything. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> Shit happens. I'm so excited. But Billy was great. And Chance was amazing. Chance was so good. I don't even know all of his songs, but he's such a good performer. He's such a good person. Yeah, like life really is beautiful. He like reminded me of it. <laughs> Not the whole last festival <laughs> called Life is Beautiful. Remember, you are, you are beautiful. You are, like you, the person watching this right now, you're beautiful. And I'm beautiful, and Sydney's beautiful, and you're beautiful. Everyone's beautiful. Cause life is beautiful. Did you know that? Did you? I, I hope you didn't forget that life is beautiful. 
Every time, what the heck, Morgan? That guy told you to stop yawning. Your eye is so red. I have blister on this eye and then this eye, I'm allergic to the mascara on this eye. Just on the eye, you're allergic yeah, to the mascara. No, literally, it's just this eye. It waters every time I wear the mascara. But this one's fine. My eye was watering when we were picking up trash. And it was like ruining my makeup. I'll insert, maybe. Maybe. If you're lucky, I'll insert a clip of my makeup because it's so good. Morgan's lucky. aunt did both of our makeup. <laughs> Y'all ain't lucky. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you don't get to see my makeup. Um, Morgan's aunt did my makeup and hers makeup because neither... Morgan or I wear makeup, so we both didn't know how to like do makeup, you know? And her aunt did a great job, and it took me like so long to figure out how to do this. But like I did it, and now I gotta take it out. People watch where you put your trash because they literally had like landfill, recycling, waste, whatever. I'm saving the planet. <laughs> One free merch at a time. We were saving the planet either way. Big facts. We're going to Vegas right now, like, you know, the strip. And tomorrow we're gonna get into Life is Beautiful for free. When I go to get haircuts, I'm like, you can get a quarter of an inch off. Yeah, I've never been to a salon. Like, if I cut my I cut it with kitchen scissors. And like, I don't like it straight, so I do a choppy. <laughs> you what? <laughs> you so what? Day three of Life is Beautiful, and my shirt was really wrinkly, so. Oh my goodness. <gasps> So we have my shirt right here. Oh my God. Wow, I actually remembered to vlog before I left. We looked way cuter the other day because you know, Morgan Zan did our makeup really good. But you know, I did what I can by not knowing how to do makeup. Alien raid happening at Life is Beautiful because I'm an alien. Did you hear that? This is Morgan's outfit. I mean my shirt, but like, you know. Oh, she did her makeup so cute. You look like a little space thing too. Yeah. I'm telling them that they didn't need to go to the Area 51 thing. Mm. They could just see us. Oh yeah, she's a vlogger. <laughs> she's a vlogger. <laughs> <laughs> the cops came and the cops came and kicked every single person out that's in the parking lot except for Sydney. <laughs> and I go stand by the crosswalk and turn, and Sydney's walking in the middle of the road <laughs> asking people for their bracelets. And um, you know. Happy baby. Sydney literally was just asking like the older people, like, uh, are you going back? Can I go? Sydney, I'm leaving. And she's like, just act like you know you're. I'm like, he's literally <laughs> losing my arm. Okay, like if he doesn't good. let go, I'm gonna scream. 4:30 a.m. We love 5 a.m. Anthony let us in his private wine cellar. Goodness. <laughs> it's 6:04 a.m. Go another. <gasps> Oh my goodness. Good morning, vlog. Hey, it's 10 11. And we went to bed at 6 a.m. Closer to like 6 30. Yeah. So, we've already been on the road for 30 minutes. And we've been up for a while. It just took us a while to get all of our stuff out of the house. So, a little flashback to Saturday. We came out of a mall and we spun a little spinny thing. I got a free drink. Free beer! <laughs> We're finessing Vegas. And then we went to like this club thing. And then went back to the spinny thing. And I was like, oh, you like, are you still doing the spinny thing? And she was like, no, like we only do it once a day. And I was like, oh, okay, well, could she do it because she didn't do it before? And she was like, yeah, sure, I have to, why not? And then she gave us two free playing cards because she was like, it's Vegas, have fun. That was the motto everyone that gave us that was like, it's, it's Vegas. Vegas. <laughs> like, uh, oh, do you do this to all your people? I know. All your visitors? We got And we got free games. And then last night, we got into Life is Beautiful. <laughs> For free, I got a VIP ticket, and the lady that gave me the ticket was like, oh, it's free unlimited drinking, but I think that was for the wristband that her friend had, and her friend was going to give me the bracelet for Morgan, and then she was like, oh no, keep that, and I was just like, okay, like, whatever, because I get it, like, people want to keep their bracelets, that's fine. Especially VIP. Yeah, like, I keep all my wristbands in, like, a little case. 
So I walk into VIP <laughs> and this guy was like, hey, come here, you want a drink? And I was like, is this where the free unlimited drinks are? And he goes, no, that's upstairs, but you're so charming. I'm sure you could just walk up and get it. And I was like, you're right. And so I start walking upstairs and this girl was like, hey, hey. And I was like, oh, no, 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 I have a bracelet. <laughs> and she was like, ma'am, ma'am. And I just ignored her and went upstairs and then somehow walked into this place. And then I started getting my free unlimited drinks and they didn't even card me. Like you could have gone up there for sure and gotten a drink. They weren't carding me. I think I had quite a few drinks. And then I got, I brought two drinks downstairs and I brought two waters downstairs for Morgan. And then we went and saw Zed, it was amazing. After Zed, we tried to go back up there well, it was right before Post Malone, so I'm sure it was like more crowded and more secure. Kind of pulled Morgan. Not like kind of. <laughs> like that was a hard pull. I'm little. Like I'm genuine. Like I'm little. And so Sydney obviously is taller and is like walking through, and I'm arm in arm with like, arm in arm with her, holding her hand, and they're pulling me back, and I'm like trying to get to Sydney. And it's this girl like tapping on my back like, hello, ma'am, 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 ma'am. And then it's some old guy who's like, what does the girl look like? I have no, I didn't, I didn't oh. look. I literally didn't even turn around to acknowledge them. <laughs> She's just going, ma'am, ma'am, ma'am. And this guy was like, I don't even know how they caught us. I don't either, but, but this old man is pinching my skin and like grabbing it. And I do have a tender spot on my arm. And he literally was like dragging me or trying to drag me back while I'm like trying to keep hold of Sydney and then he was like you need to exit you need to exit and I was like okay we're gonna exit over here and he was like no exit right there and I was like okay chill <laughs> like I don't even think he was working though I don't either like he wasn't wearing anything that the workers would and wear and he had a drink in his hand like full mind your business exactly like keep to yourself don't let us me. have our fun not gonna stop you from getting any more drinks like chill yeah. it's a private party oh, is this a Grand Canyon? I think that's the so we got free unlimited drinks we got free drinks on Saturday and we got free merch on Friday you know life's just really working out for us like really All great all I paid for was gas gas and one lunch one meal one meal and we split it and they were so good. We had the best nachos from Margaritaville. Go there, it's on the strip. Go there and have nachos because they're so good. But they're so big, like make sure you bring a friend or two. Yeah. <laughs> I cannot believe that me and Morgan almost finished it, but I also can because at that point, like we didn't eat the day before. It was already 4.30 p.m. <laughs> our first meal of the day yeah. and our only meal. I realized when I woke up at 5 a.m. the next day that we didn't have dinner. Oh, that was our weekend, Vegas. So much fun. Everything always works out for us, like, really well. I know. Like, San Francisco was the best time ever. Yeah. Bali was great. Bali was amazing. Vegas was really fun. Vegas was amazing. Yeah. And now, I officially, sort of, <laughs> moved to Arizona. Officially, uh, officially, unofficially <laughs> moved to Arizona. The day before we left to Vegas. And so we're going back to Arizona right now. She's gonna drop me off at my apartment and I'm gonna take a bus back to California and I've never taken a bus before and I'm kind of scared. She'll be fine. <laughs> but anyone that's ever taken a bus before and it's not like a freaking sundial like bus for four hours. <laughs> it's like a Cardiff bus for hours. Like a school field, she's going on a school field trip. It's fine. My options to get home because I do not have my car in Arizona, so I'm kind of just like, how am I getting home? Yeah, until I drive back up there. So it was either a 12 hour bus ride from Vegas to California or a five hour bus ride from Arizona. And I was like, well, then I can spend four hours in Morgan and keep you company. I mean, that's still a nine hour drive, but 